Hello, I'm Debbie Maycomber, and I'm a frequent eater, but I'm a frequent cook too. In fact, I spend more time in the kitchen than I ever do in the dining room. In the past, recipes were often preserved on index cards. My mother had several small boxes stuffed with them. I savored every word and learned cooking hints that I still use today. Like my mother, I've collected recipes all my life, and yes, I have several small recipe boxes crammed with carefully handwritten notes. Years ago, I chose some of my favorite recipes and created a recipe booklet as a thank you gift to my readers at Christmas time. In return, the readers sent me their own favorite recipes. This was my first venture into cookbook publishing. If you read any of my Cedar Cove series, you'll recognize Charlotte Jefferson Rhodes, who's known and loved by everyone in town, and her reputation as an amazing cook is well deserved. In the Cedar Cove cookbook, Charlotte shares her best recipes, recipes given to her by members of her family and many friends, as well as those from the kitchens and dining rooms of Cedar Cove. Like Charlotte, I believe that food is central to the important relationships in our lives. This is one of my favorites that's in the Cedar Cove cookbook, the peanut butter sandwich cookies. They are fun, fattening, and delicious. The recipe is simple. It includes flour and sugar, butter, eggs, vanilla, and peanut butter. Everything that makes a cookie great. Once the batter is ready, you roll it into a teaspoon, one at a time, into small rounds, and press them into a cookie sheet. You bake them then for 10 minutes at 350 degrees. And now the fun part starts. What makes my cookies special and delicious is the filling, which is peanut butter, cream cheese, and powdered sugar. And I know you're gonna love this recipe and all the recipes for the appetizers, breakfast, lunch, dinner, and dessert from your friends at Cedar Cove and from me in the Cedar Cove cookbook. Mmm, this is good.